The story of St. Patrick, the patron saint of Ireland, is steeped in legend and historical accounts. Born in Britain around the late 4th century AD, Patrick was originally named Maywin Sucket. At the age of 16, he was captured by Irish raiders and taken to Ireland as a slave. During his captivity, he worked as a shepherd and turned to Christianity for solace and strength. According to legend, Patrick had a divine vision that instructed him to escape and returned to Britain. After successfully fleeing his captors, he returned home and dedicated his life to Christianity. He later became a priest and then a bishop. Driven by a calling to spread Christianity to the pagan Irish people, Patrick returned to Ireland as a missionary. Despite facing resistance and danger, he courageously traveled across the island, preaching the Christian faith, performing miracles, and baptizing thousands of converts. One of the most famous legends associated with St. Patrick is that he used the three-leafed shamrock to explain the concept of the Holy Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, to the Irish people. This symbolism remains closely associated with him and is a prominent feature of St. Patrick's Day celebrations. Patrick's missionary efforts played a significant role in the Christianization of Ireland. He established churches, monasteries, and schools, and his influence helped shape the religious and cultural landscape of the country. St. Patrick is believed to have died on March 17, around the year 461 AD. Over time, the anniversary of his death became a day of celebration known as St. Patrick's Day. Today, St. Patrick's Day is observed not only in Ireland, but also by people of Irish descent around the world, with festivities that include parades, feasting, and wearing green in honor of the saint. Patrick is also known for his efforts in fighting against addiction, especially of alcohol. He was believed to have had miraculous powers of healing, and many people would come from far and wide to seek his blessing.